Okay, uh, I think one of the things that surprised... Well, one of the things that... In, uh, let me think. Uh, one of the things that surprised me, I guess, is sort of the the level of what things have been said. Like, I think on both sides, like, you find out something that this person's one candidate said or the other candidate did in the past, and I think a lot of it, like, is surprising that somebody at that level would do, and, but I mean, I don't know, this, I, I have to find the words, but, like, uh, I don't know, I think it's just the level of professionalism is not, doesn't always seem to be there that should be there, and I think that's an important thing when you're running for, like, the presidency of the United States, that you should be as professional as you can. Um, I think that there's been a lot of impressions that have at least impacted me for this election. Like, we've had Hillary Clinton, who was proven to have kind of rigged the Democratic primaries against Bernie Sanders. And, like, we saw that previously with how she did the email scandal and how there have been a lot of scandals going with her throughout her public service. And it's kind of scary to me that we would put someone in that position of being our president when when they were secretary of state they did things illegally and like knowingly illegally like it wasn't like she say that she forgot the C but like I don't know if I believe that and I don't know if I'd want to put someone in office that would knowingly like forget something like that and then with Donald Trump like just insulting like an entire race of like 15 percent of our population or in that area and like that's a big region down here like a lot of people in this area are Mexican Americans and so I don't know if I would be able to like elect someone like that either. It's kind of like you can't win in this situation.